is, is this thing on? Uh, well, um, hello everyone. Um, my name is uh, Eddie, and uh, uh, I'm just I'm just some 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 kids, and I'm I'm just here to have a have a good time, have some fun streaming some some games and, and other stuff because you know I'm an, I'm an epic gamer as as the kids call it nowadays. Um, so uh, so you might be thinking, who's this daft British cunt? Why is he? Why is he on Twitch? What's his game? Well, I just I was just bored to be honest, and I thought, well, why not? Why not do some streaming? You know, it's it's fun. It's what people do. So the the, the first thing I'd like to try out is um is 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 Half Life, because um Half Life is a is a very uh, a trendy game nowadays, I suppose. I mean, uh, you know, there was Half Life Alex that came out and. Um, and Valve is kind of in the spotlight, and um, also because actually I've, I've never finished Half Life. I I played Half Life quite a lot. I played Half Life One and Half Life Two, uh, all of the Half Life games, but I never completed any of them because they were a bit too scary for me. And uh, I I don't like horror stuff, and um, I just thought, well, I mean, you know, maybe it's better when streaming it to me. I won't be so uh, so scared about it. Uh, wait, is my is my mic fine? Just one second, I'm just gonna just gonna see if I can. Uh... Up the mic because it's not showing quite a lot of gain so let's see where's the so it's my first time doing this so I'm sorry I get some things wrong uh... hello is, is that better I, I, I'm just gonna I'm just gonna assume that's a bit better and um, you know I'll, I'll, I'll adjust it as I go along uh, let me just turn up the game audio also, just so that I mean, in-game can actually hear stuff. So I'm actually going to be using the Half-Life 2 M mod, which is like a, a graphical mod for Half-Life. It also adds other gameplay features and stuff. But um, yeah, I, I think I think it'll be something fun to do, and we'll just see how it goes. So new game, points insertion. And of course, this game is great. It has great voice acting, great, great visuals, great gameplay, absolutely revolutionary. And of course, the node graph is out of days, as usual with Valve games. Rise and shine, Mr. Freeman. Rise and shine. Not that I wish to imply you have been sleeping on the job. No one is more deserving of a rest, and all the effort in the world would have gone to waste until... Well, let's just this say your hour um, has Half -Life 1, come again. This is obviously Half-Life 1, Cascade. And uh, this is the Citadel, I believe. Or inside the Citadel, at least. The right man in the wrong place can make all the difference in the world. So wake up, Mr. Freeman. Wake up and smell the ashes. God, that 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 intro sequence—it's um, it's quite something. It's it's something that you know a lot of people have engraved in their minds, and I'd say I'm definitely the same. That that intro speech is uh, yeah, it's, it it gives me it gives me goosebumps. It's really something, really something. No matter how many times I've been Obviously the I opening reminiscent of Half-Life 1 as well when you're on the tram. This time you're on the train. And uh, welcome to City 17. Well, end of the line. Oh, good. Welcome. Welcome to City 17. There's Dr. Green. You have chosen or been chosen to relocate to one of our finest I've got some CP here. <laughs> Civil protection, not some child's, but I, I mean, anyway. Oh, God. Yeah, this, the, the, obviously, they're not nice. Um, <laughs> the Combine definitely have, have their um, uh, grip, have their iron grip over the earth fermented right now. Don't drink the water. Say it. Say it. Don't drink the water. There you go. They put something in it to, to make you forget. I don't even remember how I got here. What is this? 
Glad to see alcohol is still prevalent in the, uh, in the uh, dystopian world. I mean, of course it would be. That's just like a that's like a trope, isn't it? In, like media that uh, the dystopian world definitely has abundance of alcohol, like Victory Gin and um, in 1984 and uh, the vodka in Stalker. Okay. Nova Prospect. Sure thing. My <laughs> if you can move, don't you? In the citadel, so anyway, yeah, I've chosen to use the M mod because it's a. Like it, it really else. ups the game, game's graphical detail by quite a bit. Like, look at that. Look at that. Looks. Look at that reflection. Nice uh, dentist chair thing you've got here. About that beer I owed you. Uh, it's Barnals. It's me, Gordon Barney from Black Mesa. Hey, yeah, but which one? I had to put which on Barney? For the There's like 50 billion of them. I've been working undercover with civil protection. I can't take too long or they'll get suspicious. I'm way behind on my beating quota. Yes, uh -huh. Barney. What is it? I'm in the middle of a critical test. Sorry, dog, but uh, look, look, look it's, it's generic here. scientist Great number 54. Spot. Gordon Freeman. I expected more warning. Yeah, you and me both, Doc. He was about to board the express to Nova Prospect. Well, Barney, what do you intend? I'm thinking, I'm thinking. Alex is around here somewhere. She would have a better idea how to get in here. Well, as long as he stays away from checkpoints, we should be okay. Listen, I gotta go, Doc. We're taking enough chances as it is. Yeah, I, it's such a dystopian world. I can't believe that they don't have, you know, like... Like okay, more Gordon, surveillance in here. You're gonna have to make your own way to Dr. Kleiner. Well, I suppose lab. a combo you don't really care. Oh man, that's what I was afraid of. Get in here, Gordon, before you blow my cover. Of course, it's one of the things about Half Life 2 is the physics so engine. That, and keep going you're that in we'll be able to see soon enough. Like, you can actually move, move boxes around and assemble them. Like, wow, revolutionary, guys. That this game is, um, it really, it's really quite um, a revolutionary game. But of course you do have the classical uh, loading freeze thing that occurs, and uh, no to graph out of date, of course. Classic, classic Half-Life tropes. Not really tropes, but still. Now there's an interesting thing about this this particular combine unit or civil protection unit that I'll get into. Now you have to listen closely here. No, go rush. He didn't say because I actually interrupted him. Uh, but reporting says and summoned to voluntary conscription for general service public detail. Now, my, my my thoughts on it is that he's actually given trying to give us like a positive credit, like if we go enough like the social credit system, because. Um, Summoned to voluntary conscription. So, unfortunately, I think his his report is what alerted the combine to our presence or our lack of presence. More, more like rather than try to answer every possible yeah, question, uh, the, the civilian every month. HSSG up there. Um, obviously, this is a uh, um, a dystopian world, so it has to have that trope of uh, of Russian everywhere. But yeah, I think it's unfortunate because I think that that civil protection unit was just trying to just trying to give us some extra credit, but unfortunately, it made the combine aware that we don't exist. Damn. Yeah, imagine living in such a world like 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 people talk about how China and the USSR were all quite dystopian, but like at least at least they were human, I suppose. At least that you still had some sense of humanity, but this is just like imagine having an alien all over you. I mean, I, I think this even tops like 1984, maybe. 
Because even in, in 1984, one of the best better things is that they didn't really cement um, Big Brother as actually being human. They kept Big Brother as a concept so vague that it made it seem as if that if they could be anything. It could be one person, could be many people, but it could even be inhuman. I think that was, that was definitely spooky. Why is it being beaten up? Okay, cool. No more television. That's not propaganda for you. I mean, another thing is that I believe these two are probably... I mean, these two are a, um, a troop as well, like the comforting couple. You see them later on in the game as well. These two definitely exist for the Combine Invasion, Combine Takeover, because I'd say that if you were a person who was born during the Combine... Ah, uh, there's the miscount, that's us. There's some junk right there. I mean, I was saying that if you were born in a dystopian environment, I think you'd usually adapt to it. I don't, don't think you'd be a bit extremely sad, if that makes sense. Because you just think it's normal, you just think it's normal life. We just believe that dystopian environments are terrible because we're not, we're not used to it. We're used to this freedom that we're given. Of course, I'd much rather live in a free world than a world like this, but still. Ships, camera things. I don't actually know what they're called. Camera things. ACP down there. Getting shot at. Obviously. You'd think they'd have better aim, but you know, I suppose it's a video game. Here we meet uh, Alex. Of course. <laughs> Hello there. Dr. Freeman, I presume. Yeah, you have your own video game. Um, what is it? A few weeks ago. The Combine can be slow to wake, but once they're up, you don't want to get in their way. No, oh, no, I see what you mean. Petrol. Well, I mean, um, still petrol as well, I suppose. Got, got to get your car fuel from somewhere. I'm Alex Vance. My father worked with you back in Black Mesa. I'm sure he don't remember me though. Man, a few words, aren't you? <laughs> yeah, that sums us up quite well. Yeah, you see these these posters of the sort of futuristic look. It's quite reminiscent of. <laughs> Don't get my dad started on Dr. Green. And, um, Through here. Uh, other sci-fi, well not really sci-fi, but just dystopian worlds in general. Like Hunger Games for example also had that futuristic look about them. To, to I believe, really demonstrate the difference in, in, in technolo technological Funny, capability between us, the c c civilians, and the, the administrator, Big Brother if you will. Today we're finally on the verge of having a better way. Cool. Doctor Greater than Breen's Private Reserve. Fascinating. Danger keep out. What are these? So what do you mean keep out? There's like a voltage box, isn't it? Can't tap to these. And the lambda symbol, of course, half right there. Oh, Kleiner. Why must we all wear these ridiculous ties? Where did she get to? Lamar! Oh no, you're doing some um some some things, some tech things. Well those almost alright. Lamar's gotten out of the directory listing. If I didn't know better, I'd suspect 
trapping me. My goodness. Gordon Freeman. Who it really is you, isn't it? I found him it wandering is. around outside. But My god, maker, what are you doing? We owe a great deal to Dr. Freeman. Who is. Even if trouble does Who is. follow his wake. Whoa, technology. Damn. I must really, really teleport to the Texas. Very opportune time. Alex has just installed the final piece Damn. for our Let's resurrected teleport. I can't take any credit for the breakthrough, Doctor. Nonsense. What? Your talent Damn, it's floating. <laughs> Immersion ruins. Okay? Well, it's yeah. here. Jesus. There you are. Man, Gordon, you stirred up the hive. <laughs> See, I, I'm a Half-Life speedrunner. I know how these things work. Guy. It'll jeopardize everything we've worked for. Don't worry, he's coming with me. Uh, that's right, Barney. This is a red letter day. We'll inaugurate the new teleport with a double transmission. Uh, careful there. You mean it's working? Yes, tech. For real this time? Indeed. Because I still have nightmares about that cat. No, no. There's nothing to be nervous what about. Cat? We've made major strides since then. Major strides. What cat? Doc, since he's not taking the streets, you might as well get him out of his civics. What? Oh dear, you're right. I almost forgot. Barney, I'll give you the honor. Come on, I give me the cactus. There we go. But okay. I actually don't know how, how the trick works out, but I was actually quite surprised I managed to get it to work just now, but, you know. You know, I'm, I'm just going to pretend I'm really good at the game. Here we go. Ah, Emma, get it off me. Lamar, there you are. I thought you got rid of that Damn, man. Is, is that, is that Kendrick? Not. Never fear, Gordon. She's DB and completely is, 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 Yeah, that's, that's Kleiner for you, or, no, Black Mesa personnel. <laughs> Get that thing away from me! Here, yeah, my pet. Hop up. Oh, okay. No, not up there! No! No! Careful, Lamar! Those are quite fragile! No, not the CRT oh, monitor! Fine. How are we gonna be pissed now? Week before I can coax yeah. around there. Can we, yeah. can we get up there? But probably, but my, my parkour skills aren't up to scratch, I suppose. Yeah. Oh, God. Well, Gordon, I see your HEV suit still fits you like a glove. I'm not. I'm not going to try that again. I, I can't get it. I've made a few modifications, but I'll just acquaint you with the essentials. Now let's see. The Mark V hazardous environment suit has been redesigned for comfort and utility. Oh dear. That's the only thing you can do. The rest is just blood out. That's cool. At least get that suit you up, Gordon. Good idea. There's a charger on the wall. I've modified your suit to draw power from combine energy outlets, which are plentiful Hell wherever yeah. they patrol. Classic sound, of course. Half-Life 1. Meanwhile, let's get this show on the road. Let's do. So come on, what's some cactus? Have cactus. Let's do a book in. Come on, you need something to read as well. Come on, we're gonna read the uh, files. Gordon, why don't you position yourself near the panel over there and wait for my word? Isaac, are you there? Yes, yes, Eli. Bit of a hold up on this end. You'll never guess who found his way into our lab this morning. Uh, that's not who I think it is. Indeed, it is, and it's our intention to send him packing straight away in the company of. Yeah, that's gonna go to plan, I'm sure. Are you ready for us, Dad? We're all set on this end. Then let's do it. Let's see. Master's field flux should supplement and I take bubble, of course. Conditions could hardly be more ideal. That's what you said last time. Hey, uh, yeah, about that cat. Come on, don't worry, you have books to read. Look at that arcing, look at how much, how much, how many, how much voltage is running through it, do you think? You gonna let Gordon throw the switch? Oh, wow, well, damn, gotta throw it through the switch, hell yeah. Go right ahead. Let's do that. Very good. Final sequence. Commencing. Now. Have fun. She's dead. Time to find a new um, new antagonist. Is that is that the word? Well, did it work? Nah, she's dead. Hey, 
Uncle Tim. Uncle Tim. Uncle Tim. Thank goodness. My relief is almost palpable. Fantastic work. Well, I can't take all the credit. Dr. Freeman proved an able assistant. Let's go ahead and bring Gordon through now. Right you are. What is audio chats there? RCA chats? Hell yeah. That switch and all. I can see your MIT education really pays Yeah, I know. I, I, I'm a qualified right, physicist, guys. I, I know how to throw, throw switches. Gordon, as soon as you're in position, we'll send you... You're, you know, it's not going to work because now you're the one throwing the switch, soon. not me. So it's going to fail because he's at the switch Next. button, not me. Initialize in three, two, one. See, good he's going through the switch and it's all going to go yes, wrong. Because it's Barney, not, 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 not Gordon Freeman. Why, well, thank you. Damn, it's, it's Kendrick Lamar. Come on, get back here. Good long Seems to be some kind of Gordon, they put. We'll get you out of there. Something's throwing him away. What's the meaning of this? Yo, what's up? Who are you? How did you get in here? I I'm Gordon Freeman, bitch. They are quite famous. Well, I'm I'm inside there. Yeah, I'm fine. What do you mean? Okay, yeah, that's to be on the phone call. And I I don't want to talk to someone. Anymore. I'm I'm encountering unexpected interference. You're waking up. Oh god, someone called Steven Schilberg. He didn't come through. Then where is he? Behind you. Shut it down. Damn, spooky. It down. Oh god, no, not the paparazzi. Oh god. No, 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 no photos, no photos, no solicit. Oh. Come on, get away, get away, get away. Shoot. Close the door. I, I don't want the I don't want the journalists following me. Please, I, I know. no interviews. And there we go again. No to go off out of date as usual. Damn! Look at that. Put all those two D textures coming out of it. Hey, Gordon. So the Citadel's on full alert. I've never seen it lit up like that. Get out of City 17 as fast as you can, That's Gordon. One Take the old canal, right? There. right? They'll get you to Eli's lab. It's it's a dangerous route, but there's a whole network of refugees, and they'll help you if they can. I How come do they with you, but I gotta look after Dr. Kleiner. Oh, and before I forget, I think you dropped this back in Black Mesa. Good luck right, out there, buddy. I'm gonna need it. Thank you. All right. So go ahead. Also, um, uh, added some extra game gameplay features like the ability to aim down the sides. Uh, I'll be using that as well because I love what I'd love to, to show off what Emerald can actually do, except for just the uh, the, uh, the the uh, graphical features. Admittance to authorized personnel only. I think. Stun stick. I don't think we we'll actually be using this. But. Okay, okay. Oh, well, I say it's actually a bit more effective than the crit bar. I wasn't expecting that. Oh, I love that alarm. Oh, and using this in the water obviously um, damages you, if I remember correctly. Oh, God! 
Oh wait, okay, okay. You <laughs> can go up again, I thought I was stuck down there, I had to be crushed by the oncoming train. I swear there was more combo chasing at me, but you know, apparently not. I don't know how I aim on the sides. Uh, I don't know what blood this is. I have to look it up in a bit. It's just going to a safe place. Okay, so, so it's real. I just have to uh, have a look at what the what button this is to aim down sights. I don't even have all of the. Uh, wait, I'm gonna I'm gonna have to change this slightly. Change the blur. Yeah, sure. Actually, I'm gonna I'm gonna enable these. So so yeah, this is. Should have actually had this enabled before stream, but this is good. Oh, it's like if this does do hold. Oh, no, that's a bit better. What's the what's the what's the button to to do it? Nah, let's use mouse two and for seven even tap. I can use a uh, I don't know. Is mouse three actually? But no, no. Let's do. Let's okay. With this, let's do mouse two as usual, and with this, let's do mouse three. I don't know what mouse two is used for usually. Cool. Let's get this for that. Okay, just one last thing. I'm sorry. I do apologize. Let's just change that back to top one. I think headshots count. I don't remember if they count in the original game. But I think in this game they count on that. As in like, I think in, in Half-Life 2, the original Half-Life 2, I think they didn't matter that much. But I'm not entirely sure about that. Um, please correct me if I'm wrong. But definitely in, in M modes, like, I think the headshots. So I think that Gordon Freeman, uh, just a theoretical physicist, can defeat armies and aliens and... Okay, well I'm not going to go to the top of this, this is scary. Oh yeah, yeah. Just, so I just want to show you this, but use the stun stick in this. <sighs> they just died <laughs> from the train. Use the stun stick in the water, it damages you, which is pretty cool, right? Uh, I think it's pretty nice detail. Imagine, imagine the smell. Well, I mean, maybe, maybe Gordon Freeman with the HEV suit probably is not too bad for him. And, and he's been through worse as well, but imagine the smell of this. Oh god, okay, I remember. I need to get a box to, to, to get it, I believe. Either that or one of them. So. Oh yeah, you can also hold R. Guess I'm sorry for you, thing. huh? Good thing so. you found us. You're not the first to come through here by This is the free man. The Combine's reckoning has come. The Galunga, indeed. Look, we're just a lookout for the Underground Railroad. Main station's right around the corner. They'll get you started on the right foot. See, I'm, I'm checking out my skin. I'm sorry, I need to I'm just look at my CSGO skin. Going. Okay, yeah, go ahead. Oh, yeah. Damn. Damn, thanks for the 26 powers. What is that? Really can't afford to get noticed. Civil protection catches you down here. It's bad there? news for the whole railroad. We serve the same. Hmm. Cool. Cool. One audio aspect I really love about this game is the um, Overwatch voice. I think it's extremely well done. That and the combine radio chatter, I think. Like, they really captured 
Barnacle, of course. Classic enemy. Hey, over here! Help! Okay. Machine gunner. I think in this game, in this mod, you can take the. This thing. I believe you can actually dismount it. Yeah, they can. It's not too to dismount. I probably shouldn't have done that. I probably should have used that to my tactical advantage, but. No, no, no. No pictures. No pictures. I mean, you can have pictures, but possibly. This is actually pretty satisfying. Just, just killing the combine, I think. Oh. No, no need to race bullets on these barnacles, I'm just not like they're pursuing or anything. Oh. Hi. Over here. So keep going, popping. friend. That station was raided, but there's others up ahead. Cool. I'm gonna stay here in case any others come through. Gotta keep the railway alive. Sure, uh, have a good day. So venture forth, that's the unknown. Should I get him? Yeah, let's test out our new toy. Poor guy. Does this fence just abandon him immediately? Wait, that's it. Okay, I'll just an operational down there, but I'm not sure if I. I thought we could blow these barrels up before. It's disgusting. Hmm. Cool. Alright, let's go forwards. More combine. Can't actually damage the combine as they're coming down, I believe. Like. So, it's not killing them. I'm a gamer, I know how guns work. Right. 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 What? Oh. This is a slip, slippery time. Do what? Yeah, yeah, that's cool. This is hard to navigate. So somehow. Oh, they were they were really sending the entire army of battles off the map. It's just operational down there somewhere. Soul. Rest in peace. 
What happened there? Did, was it just me explaining that? Battle? What was that? Hmm. I wasn't expecting that, but I'll take it. Oh, is this the manhack part? Oh no, no, it's the uh, it's the it's the physics puzzle part. No, really, gotta gotta apply that theoretical physics degree. That's that's one thing I quite like about Half Life is that you're actually using physics. It's not just there as a gimmick; like, it's actually part of the game. As some other games would apply apply physics and stuff. Like, yeah, just solve this puzzle once, and that's it. But in this game, you can use it to your advantage, especially in like Ravenholm. You really use it in that area. Wait, is that is that enough? No. Is there more? Ah, oh, there's one more. Oh, there's two more over there as well. Maybe I can just make it with this. God damn it! I swear, I swear, I'm, I'm not. I'm sure I'm good at games, guys. Please, please, like and subscribe. Oh, God damn it! Are you serious? Right, one more. Plus, plus. Oh, crouch jump, source engine. Hell yeah! What's this? Wait, what? I didn't mean to do that. I don't know how I made it up there. I don't think it was supposed to do that, but that's all right. Made it up there. Poor soul. Look, look at that. Look at those, those textures, man. Gnarly. Absolutely gnarly. Uh, we're from over here. Let's just see what I'm doing. Over here. I don't want to freeze. Right, at the battle time, time to kill some more barnacles. Four things. I mean, I hate barnacles, but still, like, they're just living their life down here. It's vibing, and it's still to come and kill them. Oh, no, 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 no photos, no photos. Uh, okay. Resist. Yeah, resist the bad, bad guy in black and white. Is that a tuxedo? Oh no, I thought he had a bow tie on for some reason. Yeah, can't can't wait to take Doctor Breen to the prom, guys. And again, let's go out of date. Of course, it will be. Yeah, I don't want those guys to be loads of the shot. Um, I know it's not really effective in real life, but people seem to do it. So. Oh hi. Oh, this is the Manhattan guy, right? Be glad cool. you're not the guy they're looking for. The bastard doesn't stand a chance. Sounds like they're calling in every CP unit in City 17. Now they're flooding the areas up ahead with manhats. We better get going before they sweep through here. And here oh, they shit. come. Too late. Yeah, I'm not too fussed about racing this ammo. You don't get this gun in the game anyway. So, it's not much of a problem if I waste all this ammo. Because we're going to get an MP5 later. Uh, and I think the MP5 is... Yeah, the MP5 is in the game. But you don't... You, don't, uh, you, you can't dismount the, the gun. I think... Is this the AR2 that people talk about? Or, no, wait, the AR2 is the gun to get in the game. This is the AR3. <laughs> I don't know. Overwatch stationary the shop. Huh. Oh, oh, wait, can I can I get them through the barrel? That thing. 
sign or anything here for sure. I, should, I don't know why I keep wasting ammo them, to be fair, I shouldn't waste my pistol ammo on them. I shouldn't have done that. Oh, I did anyway. So, um, that's that. <laughs> I thought that, that 1099 thing is usually when they're about to die. But I think they have 5 hell yet. Yeah, Seize the power of Petrol Coach. Right. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Ah, yeah, the music's taking the place, but I'm gonna, I'm gonna up the volume. Because the music is actually really good in this game. There we go. That pumped. Uh. Right, so where do we go now? Um, <laughs> um well, oh, there we go. And now I've got the MP5, so I'll put, I, I could just finish using this ammo, and then I could just move to the MP5 then. right now. <laughs> like one shot on my and I'm dead. Like please that's not really cool. I'm on normal mode. I think I'm on normal mode. Let's just check that real quick. Uh, normal. Yeah cool. Is this the gas that kills me? Oh, oh no I died from the, from the steam. Steam steam killed me guys. Um what do we do then? Maybe we can go back and get some chunk, like, um, some sort of, uh, and some ammo, at least. There's actually a sort of puzzle element to it. Wait, what's the quick save button? I keep forgetting, is it F5? Take screenshot, quick save is F6. Oh god damn it. Is that actually getting it? I can't tell. Okay. Games are weird, you know, some are, sometimes it works, sometimes it doesn't work. Is there Lambda here? Is that health? Oh, that's health in there. Oh, please, I really need that health. There's health. Cool. That's actually just the, um, the thing. The, uh, man hack. Oh, we got grenades for the MP5. Cool, cool here. Yeah. Are we supposed to be here? Yeah, we are. Okay. I really don't want to be taking any more damage. Having two damage sucks. I mean, two health it sucks. I could just avoid all, con all um, contact, but I kind of want to have fun and I like shooting things. You ain't shit, you ain't shit. That's right. Yeah, that's 
right? Took unnecessary amount of damage there, but you know, who cares? It's a game. It's a game. Um, That was metal, right? So if I turn it and... Bruh, does it shock me? Bruh. Unimmersive. Right. Oh, you want more do you? I'm probably gonna stop soon. Uh, as the first part of my stream. First part of Half-Life 2. Probably gonna stop for a bit later. We'll see how long this goes on for. Probably finish this puzzle. I think this is the puzzle? I, can't, I don't remember. I, I don't remember parts of this, this game, I haven't really completed it before, so some parts are a bit shaky with um, the, the memory, I mean it's a bit vague. Um, what do I have to do here? I think there's something about turning a pump, I turn a valve, there's like a valve there, I believe. What, where is it? Uh, ah, there it is. That raises the water, right? Then we can go down. Is it? Oh. Okay, you know what? I don't care. I'm just gonna go in. You can't come in the water because you're you're fly electricity things, drones. Um. I still hear them in the other one. Uh. Can I make it across? Do I need to? Ah. Oh, okay. I see. There we go, physics again guys, you see water, uh, wood has a lower density, so it's going to float, it's, it's very cool guys. Look at this. Damn, density equals mass over volume guys. Oh god. I'm a comp compromise, no 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 no. Why is my, but it's, I was drowning, how did that hurt my armor? Whatever, I'm not going to question it. Okay. Wait, where do we get to in this part? I'm just trying to figure out, like... I think you get to the water boat sequence, or... The head crab sequence, there's like a part of head crabs and they fall down. I think I'm gonna get to that, and then I'm gonna... I'm just gonna stop playing, that's the first part. Die. Can I aim down the sights? No, you can't use the, 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 the holographic Edo tech sights. Oh. I wanted to use the reflex sight guys. I couldn't do it. Game with it now. No, no, no! God damn it. I took photos out my consent line. Got cool map. Video games work. Um, professional. Um, don't want to touch that radioactive Vicky stuff. Uh, is there zombies here? No, nice job. Hey, that's competent much? as a Barney from Half-Life 1. Coming. 
You got here at a bad time. Now I can tell. Black Mesa East to Station 6. Do you read? Dr. Freeman is on his way down river. Lend him the airboat and give him all the help you can. Repeat. Okay, that's the airboat section. Freeman has returned. It is critical he reaches Black Mesa East. So I think I'll stop here then. For the first part. I don't know how long I've swimmed for. I'm going to check that real quick. Okay, let's check my, my, my uptime one time. Oh, uh, about 50 minutes. Yeah, okay, that's decent. Decent, decent. That I'll call it I'll call it a stream once I get to the air boom. And then I'll uh, have a have a small chat. Oh, oh it's, it's Okay, you know what? That's it. I'll just gonna stop here. Because that's the uh, head crabs that come out the shells. Save the game. There we go. Okay, well, that was that was just the first first um, stream, I suppose, like my first official one. I, I actually I tried I tried to to stream Portal Two, but I messed up. I didn't have my mic connected. <laughs> GG easy indeed. Um, so yeah, if you, I mean, if if you the person who's viewing this because there's basically one person in my chat right now, but um, if you want to see more, then I'll probably stream a bit more in the future and. Um, I suppose that's it for 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 Half Life Two at Part One. I'll do I'll do a bit do Part Two later on probably tomorrow. <laughs> okay, okay, sure. Atalanta underscore I said your name. Please please donate to my to my Twitch stream. Um, so yeah, so um, that's it for now. Stay tuned for more streams in the future, and I'll see you later.